Sports. Welcome on into Call of the Night. We are here on Radio Row getting ready for the Super Bowl in Miami, but we are seeing some big stars here today. I am so excited to be joined by actress Busy Phillips. You are here yes. promoting your Super Bowl commercial so that you got coming up. Yes. And um, we want to talk all about, because we had Lily sing on, and, and she was telling us just like, what a great empowering moment it yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty uh, it's pretty incredible. Yeah, hashtag make space for women. Hashtag make space for women. Um, for every tweet using the hashtag, Olay is gonna donate $1 to Girls Who Code, encouraging more women and girls to get involved in engineering and science. That's so epic. Like, yeah, it's epic, it's epic. We're looking just for gender parity across all industries, right? Like, you know, we're, I know that it's some people are like, do we still have to talk about this? And it's like, well, yeah, yeah. we're going to have to keep talking about it until we have pay equality, until we have gender equality in all the workplaces. When you consider that half the fans of the NFL are women mm -hmm. and yet only a quarter of the ads feature Definitely. women, that's there. That's problematic. Uh, disparity there yeah. and you know throughout your entire career like you've been you've been such a great source of empowerment oh, and thanks. especially as someone who's you know doing a show and watching you do yours and and watching you with your kids on instagram and whatnot <laughs> what's sort of like the message that you hope that cricket and birdie take from your career and what you do oh life? you know listen i think that we sh we always need to keep having these conversations everyone should have conversations in their own homes about um you know equality and and uh and that people are capable of anything that they want to be capable of. But I think that the most important thing is that they see it. Mm -hmm. So um, they need to see it in action. Kids need to see it. Young people need to see it. Uh, people who are just a little bit younger than me need to see it. So um, for me, that's the most important part is that I need to, I want to make sure that in the industry that I work in, that there is representation and that I'm an active participant in trying to make sure that there is as much representation of all different types of people and genders represented in media so that it becomes a reflection of not just the world that we know around us, because maybe you live in mm -hmm. a world that doesn't look diverse. Maybe you don't. I don't know. I don't know the world you live in. I'm not right. there. Yeah. But that you could just see the possibility of what that is and what that means. Yes. And I think that that's the thing that is the key and why I love working with Olay. Like it's truly, you know, they saw this, this opportunity to step in and say, let's do this Super Bowl ad. Let's make it an all female cast. Let's hire a woman to direct it. Um, let's be inspired by the first all female spacewalk yeah. that happened last year. Let's, let's, make money for girls who code and encourage more young women to get involved um, because that industry is sadly one that really could use a boost in mm -hmm. um, having more gender parity. So look, I got, I think you got to like talk the talk. You got to yeah, walk the definitely. walk and we all have to like continue having these conversations. Yeah. Well, seeing you have a conversation when you had your show, yeah. like that was inspiring to me, of Thank course. You. And we just started this a couple months ago. We do more like sports comedy. So it's like more sports side, but I love just you being able to show your personality. And I know you're very open with the cancellation of the show. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah. What, what advice would you give us? Because we'll, we'll probably be canceled. Great. So, Great yeah. guys. I mean, Good we'll, to know. Well, our producer said everything gets canceled. Everything at some gets point. canceled. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, I mean, look, here's the thing is, is tenacity is key in all industries. And, and, um, and especially I think if you're a, a person who's in the minority in the field that you're trying to achieve, your goals in, um, you will have people sitting across from you telling you that what you want is crazy mm -hmm. or that you're not able to get it. And I think that being able to pull from within the confidence, the belief that you know that you are capable of more is so important. You know, it's what white men have been doing their entire oh, lives. Yeah, yeah. You they, know? they don't they just, care they at all. Don't, because it doesn't occur to, because everything that they see is reflected back to them is them. So obviously and it's for them and it's been made for them because the people in charge have been making the decisions on what they get right. to watch, you know, and what they get to see. And so, you know, when the whole world is like bends to you when you're when you see something different you're like I don't understand what is that what is that thing mm -hmm. I don't get it um, but it doesn't mean it's not valid right so you know I think that uh, yeah you just have to like be able to have tenacity and persistence and 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 figuring out new ways because here's the other thing like 
maybe they're not going to make room for you yeah. at the table. So just go build a couch. Exactly. And they're like, you know, make, well, a, we, make we have table. This, like, we have this. We only have this table yeah, here. This we're, is great. We're giving these two chairs. That's and great. You talk about white dudes <laughs> seeing white dudes. <gasps> reflection. I got to tell you, a lot of people tell me I look like you. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm saying it's like. I think we have like maybe a similar facial structure. This is really awkward for me to describe this right now, <laughs> but I, That's I, very yes, flattering. Um, I'm very flattered Thanks. that people are like, Hey, you look like busy Phillips. I'm like, Oh my gosh, that's super cool. So now when people say you look like Julie Stewart Banks, you'll know they're talking about I'll be, me. I'm yeah, thrilled. Like, and I'll okay. say, I'll say, I know, I know. Like, I, I did I her found show. Her. I found it's her. very exciting. And it's, we do. It's very exciting. We got the ad though, coming up for the Super Bowl, And yes, Tell everyone again, let's plug this Olay. Yeah, action. well, watch the ad yeah. <laughs> on Sunday. Enjoy it. I hope you do. We had a really great time making it. And make sure you use the hashtag make space for women. Every time you do, Olay is going to donate one dollar to girls who code. Yeah. So we are making space. Um, let's make space for, for women, women, guys. Here at let's Radio just Row. Make space there, you know, because there's not a lot women. of dudes there's a lot of dudes here and there's not a lot of women. So let's we need to make space. more space for women yeah, here. Especially Radio women, Row. you know, with blonde hair and big yeah. mouths. Yeah. We're chin twins. So you know. All right. Thank you so much, yeah. Fizzy. Um, guys, stay tuned. More to come on Call of the Night here from Radio Row.